Hey, how's it going everyone? Saints fan here. Welcome to another GTA 5 video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can actually save permanently, for the time being at least, the bodyguard vest outfit that was released with the executives update. I know I showed you guys a video a few weeks back where you could temporarily save some of the VIP or bodyguard outfits. I don't know if that still works, but again, that was only temporary and that's not really that great because you can't switch between any of your other outfits. And yet again, I still don't know why we can't just, you know, use the clothing options that came with the VIP update as just regular clothing options without having to be a VIP. Like, I don't know the reasons behind it. Maybe if we complain enough to Rockstar, they'll, you know, one day let us use that. But for the time being, this, this glitch is the only thing that works. And it only works on the bodyguard vest. It's fairly easy to do. All you need is a friend who is a VIP. And as you're going to see, we're going to start in the ammunition by the gear section. Have your friends scroll to whatever bodyguard, you know, color you want. Once you have that, equip an earpiece. After equipping the earpiece, back out and go stand by the shoe section. Once you're standing in the area where you have the ability to hit right on the D-pad to go into the shoes, have your VIP change the outfit back to none. Once he changes it back to none, quickly hit the D-pad button and just equip any pair of boots or shoes. After that, and you're going to have to be pretty quick with this, once you back out of that menu, have your VIP switch to any of the other VIP outfits and then walk out of the store. If you wait too long, it will actually get rid of your bodyguard outfit. So that's why you have to be pretty quick. Once you are walked out of the store dressed as any of the other VIPs, go to your apartment and go to the closet. Once in the closet, just stand like in the middle and get ready to hit right on the D-pad because you're going to want your VIP to change the outfit back to none. Once he changes it back to none, for a moment you should see the outfit switch back to the bodyguard. Once you see that, hit right on the D-pad and then change one of your hats. Once you have one of your hats changed, all you have to do is save this outfit and now, at least like I said for the time being, you can have this outfit and it will not disappear. From here, you can go ahead and customize it. The only thing you can't customize is the top. Unfortunately, you can't put any shirt underneath it. You can't put any overcoat on top of it. You can, however, put scarves on. You can put parachutes on. You can change the gloves. You can change the pants, the boots, all that stuff. You can do the mask and all that. So, you know, I'm excited to see if anybody can come up with some pretty cool Fashion Friday outfits that include this. I mean, if anything, it'll just make some of the military outfits a little bit uh, more different than the ones we've done in the past. But I hope you guys enjoyed. This was actually brought to my attention by Central Gaming Hub. A lot of you guys who watch my Fashion Fridays probably know who he is. I'll leave a link in the description to him. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. If you guys have any questions, just let me know in the comment section. Drop a like if you did enjoy and found it helpful. Subscribe for more awesome GTA content. And as always, see you guys in the next one. I'm out. Peace.